Trump's call. One user asked, is the sixth D-Day, is that why Trump wants everyone there? Another asserted, Trump just told us all to come armed. Fucking A, this is happening. A third took it even further. It will be wild means we need volunteers for the firing squad. Jim Watkins, the owner of 8 Coon, the fringe online forum that was birthplace of the QAnon extremist movement, confirmed the importance of Trump's tweet. Why did you first decide to go to D.C. for January 6th? When, when the president of the United States announced that he was going to have a rally, then I bought ticket and went. Watkins was at the Capitol on January 6th. Some who have since been indicted for their involvement in the attack on the Capitol also responded. One of them posted on the 19th, quote, calling all patriots, be in Washington, D.C., January the 6th. This wasn't organized by any group. DJT has invited us, and it's going to be wild. Some of the online rhetoric turned openly homicidal and white nationalist, such as, why don't we just kill them, every last Democrat, down to the last man, woman, and child? And it's time for the day of the rope. White revolution is the only solution. Others realized that police would be standing in the way of their effort to overturn the election. So one wrote, I'm ready to die for my beliefs. Are you ready to die, police? Another wrote on the Donald.win, cops don't have standing if they're laying on the ground in a pool of their own blood. The Donald.win was an openly racist and anti-Semitic forum. The select committee deposed that site's founder, Jody Williams. He confirmed how the president's tweet created a laser-like focus on the date of January the 6th. I mean, people have been talking about going to D.C. as soon as the election was over. And do you recall whether or not the conversation around those dates centered on the 6th after the president's tweet? Oh, sure. Yeah. I mean, after it was announced that, you know, he was going to be there on the 6th to talk. Yes. Then then anything else was kind of shut out and it was just going to be on the 6th. OK. And that was pretty clearly reflected in the, the, co the content on, on the site. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. On that site, many shared plans and violent threats. Bring handcuffs and wait near the tunnels, wrote one user. A commenter replied, suggesting zip ties instead. One post encouraged others to come with body armor, knuckles, shields, bats, pepper spray, whatever it takes. All of those were used on the 6th. The post concluded, Join your local Proud Boys chapter as well. The Donald Dot Win featured discussions of the tunnels beneath the Capitol complex, suggestions for targeting members of Congress, and encouragement to attend this once in a lifetime event. While Trump supporters grew more aggressive online, he continued to rile up his base on Twitter.